We came for this unit and we got it. Safe, of course. Yeah, that is crafting. Snapped in drone 1080p. That's pretty cool. Mm. A little game set. Nice. <laughs> it's like pills and jewelry. <laughs> We've got some potential right here, guys. Uh, what is this? Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. We got the money. Warrior. Sawzall. So I don't know if that's like a seed. That's a little bit of silver right there. How you can redeem these for cash. So we're going to put that aside. That's definitely something to hang on to. Mm, that doesn't look so good, does it? Uh-oh. It appears to be locked. There we go. Like I said earlier, some of that stuff is expensive. Six, seven, eight hundred bucks. And I do think this is towards the upper end. It's, it's such an, a neat looking piece. Oh, yes. Oh, that's a nice shape too. Great. Great. I like it. <laughs> All right, Locker Nuts, it is live auction time. Milpitas, is California, safe keep storage. I think they got two units today, but one of them is supposed to be really interesting. We're about to find out. guys i got it i got it we came for this unit and we got it and i'm really surprised we got it so cheap 3400 was the final price plus there's a 10 percent buyer's premium at this uh facility and i think there is at all safe keep storages so we knew that going in so 3740 i think is the total and oh man this looks good so yeah the quad wasn't included we already knew that the title is not cleared so but boy that thing was beautiful i really do wish we could have got that nice looking unit really really nice i saw the photos on this one and it it just, I don't know, it just called to me. What do you guys think? Comment below if you like what you've seen. Ooh, let me get the light on. Look at this. Got our own little timer. <laughs> I don't have to go down the hall. I love that. Yes, look at this. There's a lot of potential in here. This is a 10 by 25, and I just dig it. I dig it. We got this toolbox right here. Safe, of course. This, yes, yes. We love safes. There's, looks like LP records. I saw that in the photo. I didn't know for sure, and that definitely is what it appears to be. Motorcycle helmet right here, probably for the ATV. We see lots of tools, right? Ladder, more of those. Look at this compressor, 20. I think it's a 20 gallon. Craftsman compressor. This right here is dope right here. This is a two ton uh, jack right here. Hydraulic jack. That is nice. This guy definitely did some work on engines, I would say. Drone right here. Drone right here. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this right here. I like this. I like this a lot actually. Foster's right here. Oh, bummer. It's broken. I just saw that broken. Dang it. <laughs> that went down in value by quite a quite a bit. Otherwise, that was a really pretty pretty piece right there. Oh well. 20 bucks maybe if we're lucky. But check this out. So many boxes. The shelves alone. Look at these shelves. These are really nice shelves really nice shelves actually i might upgrade the ones in my garage with these these are better than mine but those are 100 bucks each i'd say on the used market for those we've got a bike right here we've got some sort of a mobility scooter right here the kind when you you know you put your knee right there and scoot along if you've got surgery or something acl type stuff yeah look at that big speaker box back there i see some speakers up here one thing I'm I am very interested in is these totes that are plastic wrapped. I don't think I've seen that before, or at least I haven't seen it very often. And this one right here looks like that's a Tickle Me Elmo in there. See that Tickle Me Elmo plush, as well as some boxes. And yeah, that's interesting. There's like a garbage can back there with the plastic wrap over the top too. Very very curious that is, and I like that because that says there may be collectibles in here. Because we see a lot of stuff that's just it's good flea market stuff, but of course we're really looking for the collectibles right we want the collectibles so that tickled me almost kind of a good sign see lots of tools and garage type stuff in these boxes that's what it looks like let's check out this a little bit of tools there yeah a little bit of tools there Not too much tools there a little bit more tools here what do we got craftsman okay good that's good craftsman's good mac tools be better matco craftsman good one that's not so good this is craftsman that's good yeah that is craftsman i like these they have the numbers real big on them a little 
remote right here. TV. Big measure. What's this? Made China. Oh, yeah. Look at the liners on the bottom. This guy's, this guy's so organized. Cobalt. It's Lowe's brand. Is Husky. Not bad. Oh, oh. These are heavy. Formance tool axle nut. Very nice. Yeah, that's probably worth a few bucks. Okay. Okay. There's, there's a lot of accessories and stuff in here. Pretty cool. I was hoping this was a TV, but I see right here. Glass, not one of my favorite things. <laughs> it's a little part, maybe that's to the ATV, I don't know. Fireplace insert right here. Those sell pretty good. Yeah. I'm just kind of poking around here, guys, because uh, I don't plan on going through this unit today. I have my van, you see right here. I parked it close because that semi was there. Ah, that semi. They had the semi idling, and then they had a fork lift running. It was so noisy. that I sat here for probably 10 or 15 minutes just looking, <laughs> just looking, uh, because it was so much audio interference there. So we got down here, that little tripod here. Ooh, that's a nice topper to the tripod. Lamp, nice desk right there, and then paperwork. Yeah, so I picked up a unit. This this auction was on my way to go pick up a unit that I bought online yesterday. And you guys will probably already have seen that video because I'm gonna go clean that one out today. It's five by 10, should be able to fit in the van. So that's gonna be a one and done. Uh, or not, maybe not. I mean, maybe it's like fantastic stuff and we have to go real slow on it, but it looks fun. It looks like toys, Legos, Star Wars. I like that kind of stuff. And it looks like they got some money. It's right by the Google headquarters. So that's exciting. We're gonna go do that in just a few minutes, but I did wanna poke around. Uh, but one thing I wanna do, I wanna grab this. Right here, I wanna grab this. I do not wanna leave that in the unit. Make sure that's secured. Oh, there's a drone box, it's empty. And that is the drone. Snapped in drone 1080p. That's pretty cool. I don't think it's especially high end, but it's, it's probably worth a few bucks. Feels really light, I think it needs a battery. But this, oh, light. <laughs> okay, moment of truth. Hmm. Something's shifting around in there, but it doesn't, it feels a little heavier and flat. So I don't know, it might be just something to go on the bottom of it, like a wood base or something inside. I don't think there's anything in here. Something's bouncing around now. I don't know. I think we're gonna take this home and pop it open. That'll make a fun video, but I'm not gonna do that till later today. So yeah, but I wanna make sure this is secured just in case, guys, just in case like if the owner, the previous owner were to come back and like break in the unit tonight. We'll get that out. We'll get that out for sure, right? All right, guys, you know what? I got the safe out, but I see one more box that I kind of want to go through. This looks really interesting right here. I, I mean, there's lots of things that look interesting, but let me grab that. Ooh, there's a power washer. Nice. All right. Why is it so heavy? I don't know. Okay, let's check it out. All right, what do we got? Notebook. All right, backgammon. Let's see. Yep, yeah, a little game set. Nice. Ah, a lot of paperwork. Carpet seam tape. Yeah, this looks good. Okay, state. Okay, this does look good, doesn't it? All right, empty. That looks kind of nice, though. What's this? Okay, blood pressure. I thought it was a big fat watch. Okay, never mind. <laughs> hmm. Uh -huh. Look at that. Baby Yo Dada. That's funny. Uh, face mask. And I don't see a, a maker on this purse right here. So, whatever. Just a purse. Just a purse. Hmm. Why, why did I think that looked so interesting? I think because I saw that. Victoria's Secret makeup bag. Okay, there's a coach little coin purse here. Coach, that's a good. That's a very good. It's a little dirty though. Needs to be cleaned up, but that's a good find. What's in here? Okay. <laughs> it's like pills and jewelry. <laughs> pills and jewelry. Cold Stone Creamery gift card. Let's hope. Let's hope. And I don't know what those plastic tubes are, but face masks. Right. Let's see if there's any gold in here. No, I don't think so. What's this right here? We've got some potential right here, guys. Probably nothing, but 
does not look like a diamond to me. It doesn't have that same flash, but I'll put it, I'll put this stuff aside, of course. Of course. Sketchers. Gift card. Happy holidays. All right. It's been scratched, but I don't know. Okay, here's a box that was never opened. Uh, it's some, some kind of medicine or hair growth. Okay. <laughs> Hey, there could be some value in that. There could actually be value in that. I'm going to have to look it up. If it's not expired, we probably could sell it. What's this? Another brand new package. Yeah, guys. It's like the Amazon man came to my house. Hmm. Neurotonin, huh? More, more medicine. Well, that's not exciting. What's this? These say Ray-Ban on them. Ray-Ban. They're a little sticky, though, like they're older. Those are like blue lights, I think. Blue light ones. And this one, Zenny. Hmm, that's cool. All right, guys. Well, that was not as exciting as I thought. And that's not a really good start. Huh, it's nothing. We've got so much potential in this locker. So much. Let's get another box. I'm not going to go out like that. <laughs> Let's get one more box. Monica's books right here. Mm -mm. Um, hmm. Oh, and that cup right there says M. Now, this definitely feels like a guy's locker, but we've already started to find women's stuff. So it could be a couple, it could be a family, but I kind of like that because to me, maybe some jewelry too, right? Not just tools, maybe some jewelry. That's looking a little more like tools. Let's see what's in here. The shrink wrap's got me intrigued. <laughs> that's, that's it, huh? And those are nice, but they're not like, I don't know, this shrink wrapped up. It's like, I thought they'd be really something special. That's light. Let's see what's in here. Hmm. A little honey, honey jar. It's kind of nice. That's kind of neat. A little yin yang votive candle holder right there. Yeah. No. 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 Not doing it for me, guys. It's just not doing it for me. Ah, okay. We're going to have to find another box. We're going to have to find another box. Don't stop till we find something good. It's a nice little bag right here for crafts or something. Ooh, those are some nice tweezers right here. Those are nice. Those are nice. I'm putting those aside. Those are the good ones. What's this for? Hmm. Little flashcards, brain busters, prescription glasses. Envelope full of cash, perhaps? Negative. I don't know what that is, but that doesn't look fun. Lymphatic drainage tool? Mm-mm. Not, not what we're looking for. I mean a bracelet. Oh, this is a nice one. I think those are real stones on that one. That's cool. I'll put those aside. This is glass at least. They're at least glass. They might be stones. Uh, Q&A. Journal. M. These socks. <laughs> this bin socks. Alright, that's not, that's not fun either. Dang. Alright, just getting a little bit of pile of good stuff over here. How about this guys? How about we go through this right here? And then we'll get going. I gotta get to this other unit because I gotta finish that today. Can't come back tomorrow. I guess I could come back tomorrow, but I don't plan to come back tomorrow. There's a nice manicure set right there. San Jose Spartans, a little bit of stickers. Super size light up balloon, that's cool. Let me put that aside. Because I'm weird. Uh what is this? I think I know what this is, guys, but um hmm. I think I know what that is, but I'm not going to talk about it. I think I know what that is. It's basically, it'd be something that a lady would take if you were camping to make the number ones a little easier out in the woods. I might be wrong on that, but that's what I think it is. And there's some pants here. See if we got any Columbia or stuff like that. That's good, but George. Hmm. Let's go through that in a second. Paperwork. What's that? California tan, tecton. That looks like it could be expensive, and it's... Feels like it's almost full. Here grows another one. What's this? Happy Hash Cat. That's interesting. Pull that out too. All right. Adidas. That's cool. 
I like the t-shirts. A little portable razor there, Venus. Oh, Venus. Okay. Those are some good gloves right here, and they look brand new. Okay, th well, there's one. Uh oh, what's this? County of Santa Clara Special Investigations Unit. Uh oh, someone's in trouble. I don't know. Maybe not in trouble, but sounded exciting. Huh. So far, this is not what I was thinking, guys. To be honest. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. We have the money. Oh, no money. <laughs> Got a cool little wallet right here, but no money. And it looks brand new, too. Skin brightener. Oh, all right. This we found her driver's license already. We've barely started, and we already found her driver's license. That's kind of interesting. What are the odds of that, right? Okay, a lot of stuff in here, guys. A lot of stuff in here. Wait, can I find the other glove though? So I could actually use that today. Uh, ooh, what's this? What's this? Oh, Warrior Sawzall. That's interesting. I've never heard of that brand. And what's that? A shift sector? What's that? Oh, that's a portable heater okay it's all good flea market stuff right this is some fun stuff i'll put i'll leave it here for now okay try not to knock it over i'm gonna leave that there oh we got this let's go through this still let's see at least one good thing in here booyah raiders <laughs> that's a nice little uh keychain right there i do kind of like that <laughs> nice all right there's some face bedangled the jingled things a little pride bag okay the dingleberry on there coals oil balloon j and m more bejeweled things for your face and an ornament this is a nice little bag actually got some decent stuff in here stickers and stuff what's that that's cool starbucks yeah a little coin purse from starbucks i'll bet you that wasn't cheap oh it's for your keys 8.95 hey there's another one scorpio Oh, Raiders playing cards. Very nice. And another one. Raiders. Those are five bucks each. San Jose Sharks. A little handkerchief or something. And some trash. Hey, that was a nice little bag right there, actually. That had some decent stuff in it. Sellable stuff, right? Sellable. Ooh, guys, I feel like we should keep going because we haven't really hit anything, like, amazing yet. The locker itself is pretty amazing. But uh, I was really hoping to find something to, like, really light us up for the next time. But, like I said, I got to get going. I got to get over the other unit. So um, let's pause this right now, and we'll pick up after I get home when going through that safe. There's a chance maybe there's something in there. I called an audible. So I went to Mountain View, cleaned out that storage unit. It was actually faster than I thought. That video, I think you guys have already seen. I don't I don't know how I'm gonna put these out. I think I'm, I'm gonna show that one first. So you'll, you'll know how that one turned out and why it was so quick. Uh, but I'm driving home and it's like, three a little bit after three in the silicon valley and traffic starting to get gnarly i've got like over an hour left to go home and it should be like a 20 minute drive so it's a lot of traffic on the way home melpitas so why not let's stop and go back there and do a couple more hours maybe of digging and uh i got starbucks in me i'm good i won't be able to put too much more the van's not full the van's got plenty of room, but I'm thinking like I might pull some of this stuff out, put in that locker and take some of that stuff, bring it home. So yeah, let's get, let's head over there. Just wanted to let you know, that's why I'm not going home to open a safe right now. I'm going there and uh, let's do some more digging guys. I'm really excited. All right, guys, we're back. We are back. All right, we got a garbage can. We didn't have that earlier, so that's gonna make going through the stuff a little bit easier. And uh, I only brought one though, so luckily I do have garbage bags. I do get questions from get people saying, where's your garbage bag? So they used to use these, but you know what? Every time I find a garbage can, I keep it. So now I have like plenty of garbage cans and I prefer not to use bags because it's just, it's wasteful and it's an additional cost that I don't need when I have multiple garbage cans. If I bring a stack of them, I could just fill each can up and then I bring it to the dump and dump them out and uh, we, we we don't waste this plastic but today since i only have one can we're going to use plastic check this out though i was just going through a second pass on this and i realized i didn't open the zipper right here uh so i opened it and look at this there's like a little uh glass vial there's a bunch of them and there's something in there so i don't know if that's like a seed of some sort what is that i don't know i don't think it's a pill it looks kind of like a seed but kind of doesn't too so i don't know are those magic beans maybe we put them in the ground beanstalk will grow out just kidding but then look at this that's a little bit of silver right there it's a silver ring and it's kind of nice it's not bad nice i, I, I missed that <laughs> there's another one no that one's missing the topper so there's the topper wait is that the thing i don't think so but i don't know 
That was kind of a fun little find though. A little different, a little different, a little bit of silver. First precious metals we found, guys. That's good. Uh, so let me go to second pass through the stuff we already went through and uh, sort the garbage out because I like to do that because I'm kind of OCD. And then we'll get to some new stuff. Okay, this is interesting. Uh, emptied this bag out, a bunch of receipts and stuff. But check this out, guys. Found a BART ticket, $14.55 on it still. See that right there? $14.55 is the stamp. And if you guys watched my reels or my shorts on YouTube and Facebook, uh, I put out a little thing about how you can redeem these for cash. So you can actually send these in and get those redeemed for cash. All right, so pretty good, pretty good find. I used to keep these just because I thought, oh, I'll, ch I'll change them in, uh, you know, for a no new ticket. Usually they're like two or three dollars. This one's got a significant amount of money on it, but that's worth $14.55 to me right there. It's a really good find. Okay, guys, I went through these two bins. They were over here, uh, paperwork, right? I wanted to see if there's anything important in there. There was something important there, potentially important. Got some gift cards, Walmart, Starbucks, and uh, that's like a MasterCard and at the Walmart. So we'll check the balances on that and see if there's anything. Could be, you never know, right? We recently found one that had $100 on it for an Amazon card. But this I thought was interesting. So I've covered up the gal's name, but if you see right here, notice of action, food stamps change. It says right here, it went from $250 to $20 each month because your income has changed. So her income must've gone up and she got less food stamps anyways. Um, but then in the same box as the food stamp stuff, we got a Zales receipt here for diamonds let's see what they bought all right this is not the same lady i'm covering up the the name it was purchased in 2008 not the same lady and this is another one here and this is also 2008 so uh yeah so food stamps and sales not not related but food stamps and quad kind of kind of related so whatever this was from sales which is a, a you know a jewelry store 22.99 149.99 and 429 dollars so they bought a 55 dollar production protection plan they spent a total of 3018 with uh taxes 3018 bucks on some jewelry all right this is uh so you can get it cleaned that sounds like a pretty nice piece in 2008 so we're gonna put that aside that's definitely something to hang on to got a couple things putting aside over here this is the bring home second pass it and go into our live auctions probably this purse i don't really think so but i'm gonna show jenna anyways maybe she gets crazy in the medicines and stuff like i said earlier i don't think uh sometimes they're they are expensive and we can sell them on ebay but i don't think those are gonna be worth anything oh and i got the lovely silver ring on too see that Woo. And put these quads aside oh, that is really interesting i wonder what type of battery that goes in there hmm nope that's not gonna fit in there okay it's gonna go in here there's a not too much room in here but we do have a little bit of room but there's a lot of a lot of stuff in that last locker a lot of legos in there i'm sure you guys watched that probably it's legos like crazy Mm, that doesn't look so good does it i don't know if that's really aloe stuff in there it looks like a pee pee <laughs> i'll let that go oh what do we got here oh this looks kind of interesting okay that's i think for cleaning your wheels lifex.com led power supply okay staples bracket ah it looked like it had a little knife or something in there Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's good. A little clamp. Hmm. It's an LED light there. Hmm. This is RC car stuff here. Probably going to want to put that stuff aside. A little Apple charger. That's nice. Dasco Pro brick set, huh? Did you hear that? <laughs> it's got a nice ring to it. Scorch. I think this is for some sort of a torch. <laughs> that's nice bottle opener sierra nevada that's actually kind of cool right there a mm, whole bunch of parts yeah what do i do with that fishing gear oh well this is kind of nice but oh well <laughs> not for long oh boy okay let's put the keys aside there's a nice brass piece uh-huh there's another piece of this Maybe to that? I don't know. Hmm. What's that for? It's a bunch of junky junk in there. Let's see what's in here. C's coffee cup. It's got a nick though. Project 62 bowls. Which 
shower head there. Some more bulls. Sengo, Nova Brown. Plastic. Gibson Home. Gibson, I think, is a decent brand. I don't think it's expensive, but decent. What's this? Okay, just some silverware here. Flatware, whatever you call it. Oh, there's a bunch of brand new stuff here. Okay. It's nice. Gibson House. Yeah, that's cool. It's a flea market. Okay, what's this? Slime. I think this is a air pump. It's interesting, the slime brand on it, though. That's like for uh, mountain biking, right? They got the slime in the tires. A little air filter here. I don't know if that'll sell. We'll find out. And what do we got here? Whoops. Decent clamp. That's interesting. One side's so much longer. Nope, never mind. <laughs> Not interesting at all. It's just the rubbers are falling off. Okay. What we got here? I don't know what that is. Oh, I think it's to strap uh, shelves to the wall. A nice little glove here. Air wick. Let that go. Some tools. And some uh, extension cord right there. Workforce. Okay. What's with only one glove? We're finding glo gloves by the singles here. I don't know. I don't know. So much miscellaneous stuff. Wait, is this a handbag? Okay, what's this? Brandy. <laughs> Face mask and some orange peels. That's pretty gross. <laughs> so, what's up with this? As old as time, a twisted tale. What if Belle's mother cursed the beast? Hmm, that's interesting. Monkey flask, serious monkey business. Huh, what is that in there? Oh, unisex imitation urine novelty kit. What? Ready to use right out of the box? Our right, a unique flask design containing three and a half ounces of the highest quality pre-mixed imitation urine. Allows for discreet concealment and ensures proper heating. For up to eight hours, what the heck? Well, I do not understand what that's for. I do not get that. I don't, I don't. See some hair products here. Bra, a little hair clip. Body firm, crepe erase. Boy, more paperwork. They've had a ton of paperwork already. I've actually filled the first bag already, and it's extremely heavy. That's some more good tweezers right there. I'll put those aside. And a little bit of makeup. All right, not too much fun in that box. In the bag here, nah. Let's see. Yeah. I'll let it go to the market. Wow, look at these jack stands, guys. Three tons. That seems like a lot. And we got some right here too. Pro Series. Those are nice. Ooh. Oh, that's really good. It works. Really good, now it works. Ah, oh, dang it. I found that cord somewhere. Ah, it's gonna be one of those lockers. Everything's like, <laughs> everything's mis mixed up. Oh, yo, yo. Okay, I did save it though, so I just gotta find it. And uh, that's a good little vacuum. All right. Yep, there we go. Okay, this is a, wait, what's this? I think it goes on the window. I don't know, it's ripped up though. We'll, we'll let that go. This right here goes to this. Okay, now we're making some progress. Match, it's, we're playing the matching game. <laughs> the matching game. Except for the gloves, there's a third glove we only have one of. Oh, that's really kind of funny. What's this? It looks like it goes to this. I bet you it sits on top. This right here, I know what this is. This is a um, clothes rack right here. It'll probably sell, but it's a cheap one. Oh, okay. This is a Dyson right here. See that? That's Dyson parts, the extension tubes, the rollers for the bottom. This is this is a decent find right here. Um, but I need the actual vacuum part. Oh, look, one more glove. Does this guy have one hand or what? That's so strange. Husky. Hey. Look at that nut driver. Locker nut driver. Yuck, yuck. Pittsburgh, Craftsman, and another Pittsburgh. Okay, I'm just starting to put all these in here. Well, maybe it's not here, here. I guess it could be there. What's in here? Just a bunch of bags. Whatever, I'm just gonna start stuffing all the tools in here. So we go to the flea market, it's easy. Wow, look at this, fly swatter. Dang, that's heck of nice. Good. 
kill big old bugs with that. I might have to keep that. House. Why? Why am I keeping that? I don't know. I don't know. I'm weird. Ooh, there's another motorcycle helmet. Okay, what's this? <laughs> Looks like a tackle box and the door hardware in there. Why not? There's some fishing gear in here. And there's more door hardware in here. Why not? And a little bit of tools too. But why not? Okay. There's the back piece of something, a cushion. Okay, back to this. That's right. Um, eh, it's okay. It looks pretty well worn. Missing the shield right here, so not super impressed with that. Not super impressed. A little sweater. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is good. The Ninja Professional 900 watts. This is a blender, Ninja blender. This is uh, somewhat decent, I think. Decent enough to put aside. It looked clean, too. Okay, what's this? Shower curtain? No, this is draperies. I think, or it's a shower curtain. It could be whatever you want it to be. Whatever you need. Whatever you need. That's whatever it is. Oh, this is cool. It's like a leather bag right here, a briefcase. Okay, sleeping bag. And this is a Northwest Territory. Looks pretty decent. It looks clean. I might need to get another garbage bag to put that in. Uh, and then we got a coffee maker here, Black & Decker. Decent. I know I'm not really working very efficiently right now. I'm just kind of pushing stuff around, but we're just having some fun exploring. Diamond blade right here. <laughs> it's a little TV tray right here. That's what that is. Yep, pretty cool. Pretty laptop, actually. Yeah, pretty neat. These slide underneath the couch. And uh, we've had these before. I haven't found one in a long time, but they slide under the couch and you just pull it out and set it up. It holds your laptop, holds your, your dinner plate, whatever you need it to be. Mm, what a neat case. Splitting open right here, but it's just got that look. It's old. I like it. Uh-oh. It appears to be locked. Huh. Hmm. Reminds me of like an old doctor's kit, you know? I see paperwork in there. It really is splitting up a lot. I don't really want to bust it, but it looks like actually somebody else has messed around with it. Because the metal's not flush. It's like pulled out. Someone probably already picked this thing. Why'd they lock it back up though? There we go. Fixed it with a Phillips screwdriver. I got skills, guys. I got skills. Okay. Paperwork. Paperwork. All right, let me go through this. I'll let you know if I find anything interesting. Hmm. Some sort of a belt right here. It says arcade on it. Okay. Got a sign. Broken planter. Hey, guys. Got some dirty towels here. Dirty. Dirty. That one's maybe got a little bit more life in it. I don't know. Home Depot buckets are good. It's a couple bucks each. Oh, what the heck? Something spilled in here. I didn't even knock anything over. So that's a little strange. Doesn't smell bad, so <laughs> it's just water. I uh, hope. Dang, more paperwork. These guys have way too much paperwork. All right, again, I'll go through this. I found nothing in the other thing. I mean, I found a uh, birth certificate, income tax stuff. That all went in the bin to get back to the owner, so. Oh, man. Let me go through this. It right, looks like we got a lot of clothes in here. A lot of clothes. Crepe erase. Oh, that's funny. I found a bag in here that said crepe erase. A little. That is sealed too. That's sealed brand new. I should bring that back. That should be a piece that we're going to look up. Some of this stuff is, some, like I said earlier, some of that stuff is expensive. Some. Some of it. All right. We'll go through this too. We found a couple of good t shirts in this already. So, um,. Definitely gotta be looking at this. Oh, this is cool. Look at this. Oh, whoa, this is super cool. Look at that. Jack Skellington. Disney. Nightmare Before Christmas. That's fantastic. They're super soft, too. They're fleece. I like it. So that's the kind of stuff we're gonna be looking for. Um, a little bit better stuff. Universal thread. That's good. That's good. A's lighter. Not so good. <laughs> Alright, I'll go through this too, guys. That one's kind of cool. Yiddy. Yiddy, it's a size large and it was 45 bucks brand new and it's kind of neat. That was pretty much it for that, except this. 
copper compression. So I think these, I don't remember for sure, but I think these have a little bit ex more, they're a little bit more expensive. So I think they might have a little bit more resale value. I don't remember last, I know when I get these, I bring them to market, people pick them up right away in the morning, but I'm not sure if it's for resale value or just cause people need it. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, we got a nice little desk. That's decent for sure. Well, it's, a, it's all right. It's all right. Huh, not bad. Scar Audio, huh? VX200-ST. Hmm. Seems kind of decent, too. All right, now that we got a little bit out here, see the desk, the smoker. All right, we didn't really talk about that, I don't think. Smoke Hollow, I saw that in the photos and I looked them up and they're, they're anywhere from a couple hundred bucks for a small one up to like six, seven, eight hundred bucks. And I do think this is towards the upper end. So we're gonna have to open that and see what it looks like on the inside. Hopefully it's clean. I'm not gonna do that right now. Um, okay, that's empty. And dustpan. This I thought was super cool too. Oh, that's actually kind of heavy. Um, dang it, it's all busted out though. See that? Bunch of broken pieces. It's, it's such an, a neat looking piece. I thought maybe it was real cane. Just the fact that they liked stuff like this made me a little bit more interested. But it's, wow. I bet you could get a little Dremel and smooth these out and then just paint them black and it'd be totally fine. Cause it seems to be in there pretty good. It's just a neat piece. That'll sell at the market for sure. Oh, chemical guys. Stain extractor. It's a good, some good stuff. That's what we've been using to wash our cars. I like it. Okay, a little bit more tools here. Some. Oh, these are. This is Klein right here. That is good stuff right there. That's a nice piece. I'm gonna put that aside. These can go to the market. I guess I'll put them there. Oh, it's a magnet. <laughs> a couple magnets. Okay, some shop lighting. Hang that in your garage. Coda LED shop light that's pretty nice that will definitely sell everybody needs more light in their garage well, maybe not everybody but boy okay there's a few batteries that are like welded together not welded but taped together and then soldered together i'm gonna try this i don't know why i just feel like i, I want to oh it's dead okay curiosity killed the cat so they say Okay, that looks like a nice uh, guitar strap right there. And this tripod right here looks pretty decent. Design in West Germany, what the heck? What's the brand though? Jeez, look at this thing. Video head fluid system made in West Germany. Oh, this is, this is not, this is not a cheap piece right here. This, this is a few bucks. I don't know how much exactly but i'm thinking that's probably 30 40 bucks at a good flea market Ma oh there's the name belora belora maybe we can look that up belora tripod okay nice little lamp these are a tough sell at the market though i don't really like finding lamps they do not sell really really tough sell all right I don't know what spilled in here. It must have been when they lifted up the thing. Maybe something got knocked over. I don't know. But it's in the shoe, which is kind of... That's it. That is a little bit odd. It'll dry out. It's just plenty warm here. Uh, there's a blender part. Maybe for that ninja we found. Hmm. I'll put it aside. This is a part to a lawnmower right here. And uh, funky junk. Wait. Oh, wow, it's heavy. Look at this. <laughs> got a couple pipes right here. Oh, that's funny. Wait, it's got some eyes glued onto it. A couple decent pipes. I wonder if that's Murano glass. Just kidding. Another pipe. And what do we got in here? Nothing. This is the what where the weight was coming right here. This is a, a base for something, metal base. Look at that. Four gigabyte data card. Just, just chilling in here. So that's where I keep it. <laughs> that's, that makes sense, doesn't it? Just kidding. All right. This is good. Two inch hitch, 15 bucks. A couple of oil things there. I don't know what that's for. Oh, what do we got here? Tea? Wouldn't you care for a spot of tea? Or how about some jam? <laughs> she 
Chicago Electric Soldering Gun Kit. This, ooh, that's a nice one. That's a few bucks. Okay, this is uh, this is kind of funny to have a mattress uh, bent like that, but now well, it make it easier to load it, I think. And it's in plastic. That's good. It looks like there's the box spring doubles, probably. Yeah. You know, it actually looks like a decent mattress too. Let's see what's behind it. It's the fun part. Oh. Okay, we'll go through that. What do we got back here? <sighs> tools. More tools. Ooh, what's this? That's a laptop right here, baby. Heck yes. Heck yes. Oh, yes. Oh, that's a nice shape, too. Wait. What's this doohickey? Huh. That's weird. That's not supposed to be like that. It's like he pulled out the power connector. Hmm. Well, I don't know. But <laughs> laptop's good fine. What's going in the keeper box? Okay, that was good. Um, what's this? Beer mirror. Henry Weinhardt. Nice. Oh, uh, yeah, it's cool. Oh, there's the lawnmower. Okay. Airfield Supply Company. I never heard of that. Never heard of that, but that's where that goes to. Okay. What? CBG Isolate Powderize First? What the heck is this stuff? CBD Isolate, small amounts. Huh, I wonder if that stuff's worth it, something. Little bag. Oh, this is good. Look at this. Nightmare Before Christmas, Advent 12 pack. Oh, there's socks. Oh my goodness, this is great. Is this a sealed bag? This is a sealed bag with 12 different socks, all Nightmare Before Christmas. This is actually really cool. 12 days of socks. Oh. Nice. All right. This is someone's uh, Christmas present. They open it and put it right back in. What's this? Okay. Facial masks. A whole bunch of facial masks. Maybe my girls will like this. That's cool. All brand new. Huh. A calendar. It says number 2023, so I think that is uh, this year, right? So maybe there's still a market for it. And this one... This is a little journal thing, a guided journal all about the awesomeness of me. We put a couple of journals aside, so I'm going to put that one aside, but my hands are getting dirty here. I don't know if I want to touch this stuff. It looks like a brand new card right there. I'm not going to open it. I'll put it aside. I don't want to get dirty. My book about me. Someone's really into themselves. <laughs> That's Dr. Seuss. Princess Tiana in the Royal Ball. Nice Disney book. What's this? 24 karat gold eye mask designed for fine lines and wrinkles. Hmm. Huh. Expires in 2024. That is still good right here, guys. Is that some money? Sure looks expensive, but who knows? Placements. The brain. Handmade card with envelope. Best day ever. That's brand new. Put it aside. Guys, we I put the cards aside because we do lock those up and we put them in our live auctions. All right, let's grab something else. How about this? Aura Medical. Ooh, what's this, guys? I see a USB connection here. Lithium ion battery designed in the UK. What is this? There's a power button. What? What? It turns on, but what does it do? There's a little connection right there. Aura Everall. Vibration technology. What? Oh, maybe this is for your back. Like to roll it? I bet you that's what it is. You know, you, you do those rollers, right? To crack your back, you lay on it and roll it back and forth. And then it vibrates. That's interesting. Uh, what's this? Mr. Heater, little buddy. That is really cool. So this screws onto a propane tank. And then I think you probably... Oh, look, it's even got a starter on it. Fire it up. Blows out heat. That is a very nice piece right there. I like that. <laughs> Heavy little can right here. And that's why. Look at this. Jeez. Heavy. Straight up steel. Hmm. I'll leave it in there. Okay. Vacuum hoses. Miscellaneous parts. That's what it appears to be. A little calculator. Sharpie in a metal case. I've never seen that before. Hmm. Huh. 
wireless voice gateway uh yeah at&t box here i don't think these have value eris bgw 210 i don't think this stuff's got any value huh bgw 210 yeah uh, i don't know though i don't think so but i don't know it's hit or miss when we bring them to the market sometimes people pick them up sometimes they don't I know I'm like just moving stuff over here, but next time I come here, guys, it's going to be with my trailer. So this stack I'm making over here, it's kind of sloppy and that it doesn't matter because it's just going to go right on the trailer. Right now, I'm just, I'm just going through stuff. We're just having some fun. Ugh, look at that. Rolling knee pads. That's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. Never needed that, but I could see how you benefit from that working on cars or whatever, you know. Let's grab this. All right shaver kit that's kind of funny though uh earphones in the middle of all that and what is this this is like a wireless ones or something it's got a charger hmm it's a little different new york taxi keychain let's take a look at this this looks like a nice pole well, this is made in china so that is that quantum pitch and reel hmm huh. 20 bucks on it, it says 20 it, it feels nice hmm that definitely feels kind of nice Let's see what we got in the backpack <laughs> that's a big old cone right there old spice volcano it's been used razor it's a personal hygiene stuff here a couple more razors yeah that's it fast acting to acting Hmm, Colgate, brand new. Expires in 23. I'm taking that. Leave in conditioner. Uh, lots of socks. Toothbrushes. Harry's shave gel. That's nice. That's nice. Oh, this is good. Old Spice sweat defense. It's a spray on. I might take that. Nice hat right there. Mmm, okay. Shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. I'm gonna take that too. That's some good stuff. Another brand new Colgate. Now we're hitting the lottery here, guys. <laughs> There's swagger. I like that. Okay. Some personal stuff there. I'm gonna keep. Oh, yeah, another one. I do like that VO5 team. I do. I do. Eye World. Just little caps for an earphones. There's another VO5. Wow. This is good. Saving me some money. And you know what I always say? Come on guys, say it, say it with me. Saving money is making money. I really do believe that. Oh, Nipsey Hustle. That's the guy that got killed not too long ago, huh? Alright, that, that'll sell at the market for sure. Alright, it's a good little bag. I mean, <laughs> not really, but I found a few things that I'll be using. Okay. Yep. That's a shell for an RC car. Hopefully we find those RC cars in here. I, I mean, I'm really hoping that we find some video games too. I don't know, I don't know why, but I'm getting the vibe that this guy. Yeah, I've not found any video games, but I just have a feeling this is nice right here. Look at this Air Jordan uh, duffel bag right here. That's nice, and you can tell it's good quality too. I like the zippers right here and the pulls. Good stuff. Oh. <laughs> Fitting Jordan bag. We got some Jordan shoes, guys. There's some 20, well, 23, but that's Jordan's number. Great, great. Wait, wait. <laughs> Are these fake? I think these might be fake. No, maybe not. Uh, I don't know. 314 304 103. I don't know. Mm, maybe not. Maybe they're real. Oh, please be real. Please be real. Please be real. Please. Pretty, please. With sugar on top? These are small, though. 314 304-101. There's six... This is six youth. And this one... Six youth? Okay. Um, They're not worth as much. You know, the youth ones. Raiders. There's more Jordans right here. Jumpmans. Boy, they sure feel real. 331815-105. Another six youth. There's some... Here's some more uh, Nikes, anyways. Nikes. That's a nine and a half. AH8050-005. Hopefully we can get a comp on this. I don't think those are gonna be big money, but these Jordans are gonna be decent. I wouldn't be surprised if these are 40 to 50 bucks each because they're youth, you know? If they weren't youth, they'd be worth more. There's some Nike slides, they're well worn. Oh, these are cool, Air Force Ones right here. What size are those? Six youth, okay. 
I don't think anyone in my house wears six youth, so that's too bad. Oh, what a good little bag right here, guys. So all these shoes right here and the bag, I'd say that's probably at least, I don't know, 200 bucks. 200 bucks, I'd say. I think that's a pretty good guesstimate. One more pocket, nothing. That bag actually might be a keeper. That's either a keeper or that's something to go on whatnot. Hey, where's the other shoe? Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna put that aside for sure. Oh, sure. Show. Okay, that was nice. <laughs> That's, yeah, it's a, a little bit of good stuff and a little bit of not so good stuff right here. But look at this. We got all this. All this. Popcorn. <laughs> I don't know if anyone will buy the popcorn, but you know what? I'll bring it to Stockton. If somebody wants it and save them a few bucks. That makes me happy. Okay. Oh, there's the other Nike right here. The other slide. Sweet. Someone still might buy those. And what do we got here? Air Force Ones, right? Whoa, really well worn. Those go to Stockton. But this, there's some more airs. These are eight and a halfs. Ooh. Ooh, that's a little big for me, but uh CJ0949-100. Those are um those are pretty nice. A little bit of wear right here. Still, those are those are a decent find. Okay. All right, I'm gonna keep it going. Keep it going. Oh, look at this Google Google backpack. Oh, I like it. I like it. We were just down in Google's neck of the woods earlier today. Bought that unit in Mountain View, and that's where Google is located. Don't, it says. It says don't. Some Converse. Oh, those are nice. Whoa, those are really nice. Oh, and by the way, guys, did you notice I wore my sandals to work today? I do have my boots in the truck, but I was hoping to not... Uh, not use them. This is a six youth 313194-600. Those are kind of cool Hey, those fit me <laughs> yeah, I got small feet <clears throat> Hmm. It's not bad. They actually feel pretty good, but I like my Birkenstocks these I just love these shoes I walked all over Disneyland in these and yes, I got a little bit of blisters by the end, but that was like over 50,000 steps later Converse Nerf dart. Um, this is a, a really, I, I think, a cool backpack right here. Yeah, I like it. It says Google, and I'm a YouTuber. Bada boom. Oh, look at this. It says don't trip. <laughs> don't trip. Funny. Oh, this thing up here. Oh, this is a, uh, I think, because I saw, uh, what did I see this right here? Space plus ice system. I think that's what that is. I think you put ice in there and it circulates, and that's for like if you have an ACL surgery. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's making a lot of sense because you've seen that scooter back there. Yeah, that's what that is. Okay, a little bit of uh, pipe here, or uh, uh, tubing, rather. Tubing, huh, that might go to the, that, I don't know, what's this thing for, though? I don't know. I'll just put it in the flea market. All right, that's good. A little spreader. And then, of course, you see right here, Another helmet. That looks like a, it was a nice helmet. It's very filthy though. And then up here we got another helmet. And right here, fresh little hat. It's funky fresh. George. Okay, this one's nice. That one's pretty nice. Yeah, that's a good helmet. I'll keep it in here so it doesn't get too scratched up. But look at this thing. It's even got the microphone in there. Yeah, that's heck of nice actually. Whoa. That's like... Yeah, yeah, it's a big vest. And you know what, leather vests sell. I'm put it aside, that's a good piece. Good, good, good piece. Nested wood crate here, five bucks it says. Not in Stockton it's not, but I like how they're thinking. I like it. Okay, ooh, yeah, look at this. Yeah, oh, Washington, Texas. Oh, this is cool. Utah, Virginia, Louisiana. In California, I almost always find only California plates. And I've got uh, quite a few put aside. We'll auction them. That's something we'll put in our auction. It's not something I collect, but we'll auction that. I don't know what that is. Another empty bottle. Dude's been partying in here or something. Something. What's this? I think it's a bottle opener. See that? That's, that's cool. Or is it a lighter? Wait, what is this? I think it's a lighter. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, it still works. It's a lighter. That's pretty funny. All right, it's going to the flea market, but yeah, still it's funny. Empty bottle again. Got a lot of trash. A lot of trash mixed in with their stuff. Some marble in there. Okay. 
timer for your um, hose there. And uh, broken scissors. Boy, there's a, there, there really is a lot of trash in here. This is cool. This is the solar panels right here. It's a little light. It's cool. We got some paint here. That'll probably sell. There's a little bit in there. All right. There's an ice maker for your fridge. How funny. Oh, hopefully there's no fridges in here. Light bulbs, LEDs. Some sort of... No, this... Wait, what is this? I don't know what this is. This is EDT, but I don't think that's what it is. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, guys, we're going to have to wrap this up here because I don't want to be late getting out of here. Wait, what is this? Dang it, that's another P jar. What the heck? What the heck? So gross. So gross. All right. This doesn't look super interesting. And you know what I mean by super interesting. I mean, I, I really would like to find some collectibles in here. Tickle Me almost got me kind of interested. We might find an entire video games. We've got those big speakers up there. Techniques. There's potential there. I still think these guys might have some collections in here. Boy, they got a lot of they got a nice collection of garbage left behind but i think we might find some good stuff in here guys i think we're gonna be i think we're gonna be all right that went way longer than i thought so um we do have that safe i'm not gonna do that in this episode guys we'll do that next time <laughs> I'm not trying to tease you guys i just think like can't go super duper long on these videos so we'll open it we'll find out and then we'll um we'll be back here digging and filling a trailer we also bought another one at this place so uh we'll be doing that one too it's just a little one this is the one that really uh got me interested and i'm so glad i came to the auction i say this so many times guys and i'll repeat it you got to come to the auctions like today i thought there's gonna be a ton of people the auctioneer said he thought there's gonna be 20 people there really should have been 20 people here but there was two other live auctions happening at the same time my airpods are firing off for some reason there but there was a um, two other live auctions today in the bay area one with 12 units and the other one had a whole run so um i think that split the buyers up and i think some buyers weren't so happy that the quad didn't get sold with the unit but th they never do so i don't know if that's for sure or not but um anyways ugh, me and three other bidders really unbelievable unbelievable i really thought we we're gonna pay double on this i'm glad we didn't because right now we haven't found like excellent stuff and things like this being broken and so much garbage already i'm glad i didn't pay seven or eight thousand for this but i would have i would have and um yeah i think we're gonna make a lot of money on this and i think we're gonna have a lot of fun all right going through it together all right you guys with me we'll be back here soon until then good luck to you god bless you and we'll see you next time here on locker nuts cbg isolate cbg i don't know if that's like cbd it's just a bunch of screws and stuff in there oh this is good Power inverter, 1000, that's cool. You hook that to your car battery and plug stuff in. That's neat. CBG distillate pellets. What's CBG, guys? Let me know. Is, is it like CBG?